Hi friends, today we would like to discuss the MSc Molecular Microbiology previous entrance examination paper 2019. So let's begin the our discussion part A. Which of the one of the following statements is not correct regarding the spirochetes? The answer A. They have endoflagella between the outer membrane and the protoplasmic cylinder. Thus, they are located in the periplasmic space of the cell. Yes, spirochetes do have the endoflagella and which is present inside the uh, periplasmic space. It origin from it originates from outer membrane, but it cannot come out uh, from the cell wall. So that's why they do have endoflagella, also called axial filament. B. Spirochetes, like other bacteria, swim best in media of low viscosity. It's wrong. They try to swim in the high viscosity. They are best viewed using dark field microscope. Yes, we can observe under dark field microscope. The spirochetes have an ability to twist or contort their shape due to occurrence of special kind of flagella, terminal periplasmic flagella. Yes, it is correct. So the answer is. The answer is B. The B is the uh, uh, wrong. Means it's not correct. Then, an epidemic disease of paddy that caused the Bengal famine is. The answer is a brown spot disease of rice by Helminthosporidium. That is the answer. Helminthosporidium. It was occurred in 1943. So which one of the following are functions of maintenance media? So in maintenance media, used for assay of vitamins and amino acids, used for determining the bacterial content, used for determining the type of growth produced by the bacteria, used for conservation of viability and physiological uh, characteristics. So the best answer is B because maintenance in the question we have the answer that maintenance media means we, we need to maintain the uh, cultures uh, for long period of time for long period of time so that's why the function of the maintenance media is uh, like maintaining a viability of cells and also their physiological characteristics next question what is cordlon is cordlon is a polymer of beta 1 3 linked glucose uh, res residues so cordlon is nothing but a polymer of a polymer of uh, beta 1 3 linked glucose uh, residues this cordlon is produced by the alkali gens it was first invented in 1966 and it is also present in other bacteria like agrobacterium and uh, Rhizobia and also in Cellulomonas. So it is a polymer of 1,3 linked glucose residues, not the 1,4 glucose or 1,3 linked galactose or 1,4 linked galactose. Kelps are which of the following type of algae? So kelps are belongs to the uh, brown algae. The answer is brown algae, not red algae, not yellow or green algae. Uh, nothing but so they are uh, seaweeds, uh, they are present inside the underwater. Next question Anthromycin, Tomamycin, Neothromycin are which of the following type of antibiotics? The answer is they are anti tumor uh, uh, agents because they try to bind to the minor group of the uh, DNA and also. They are involved in the DNA alkylation. So they are anti tumor uh, uh, agents, but they are not antiviral or antifungal or antibacterial. Which one of the uh, following bacteria requires nicotinic acid as a growth factor in their media? So the answer is uh, Proteus vulgaris that requires a special factor for growth of the that bacteria that is called. And nicotinic acid. Which one of the following reagent information is correct regarding the uh, Lucas uh, reagent? 
So Lucas reagent is a mixture of concentrated HCl and anhydrous zinc chloride and it is used for distinguishing of uh, used for differentiation of three types of alcohols primary secondary and tertiary and the answer is a it's not a alcoholic solution of k2hgi4 or copper sulfate or copper sulfate and alkaline sodium potassium tartrate solution so it is a mixture of concentrated hcl and anhydrous zinc chloride used for distinguish three different types of alcohols what is perisperma what is perisperma so the answer is b the layer of nutritive tissue derived from nucellus that surrounds the embryo of seeds in some angiosperms the answer is b so it is a, a layer of nutritive tissue derived from nucellus that surrounds the embryo of a seed in some angiosperms next question which one of the following statement is incorrect of conjugation in bacterium a cell with aplasmid produces sex fili through through which dna is transferred from donor to recipient cell during conjugation in hfr cells bacterial genes close to the origin are transferred first to the recipient cells in f prime cells the f factor genes along with bacterial genes are transferred to the recipient cells both dna starts of aplasmids are first replicated and then micro and finally transferred to the recipient cells the answer is b is in incorrect because only one strand will get replicated once the strand enters into the uh, uh, cytoplasm of the recipient cell bacterium then it undergoing for the uh, replication not the before so remaining three are correct but b is the wrong what is the uh, meso form of tartaric acid meso form of tartaric acid is neither dextrorated or levorated it is neither levorated Levo or not dextrorated due to internal uh, compensation. Next question 14. Chromatium okeni uses which one of the following compound as electron donor for photoautotropic uh, growth? So the answer is hydrogen sulfide because it belongs to the uh, anoxygenic photosynthetic bacteria and it is a gram negative. Purple sulfur bacteria. It is a gram negative purple sulfur bacteria and it forms the anoxygenic photosynthetic bacteria, means uh, evolving of oxygen. So that's why that is called anoxygenic photosynthetic bacteria, means water cannot donate the uh, electrons. Instead of that, hydrogen sulfide involved in the electron donation. So due to that, there is a production of sulfur. There is a production of sulfur so that is about the anoxygenic photosynthetic bacteria next question number 17 the broad spectrum digestive enzyme formulation designed to support optimal breakdown and absorption of proteins fats and carbohydrates is known as it is nothing but uh, protozymes basically broad spectrum means they do have different types of enzymes like enzymes which are involved in the digestion of different types of food substances or uh, proteins they are involved in the breakdown and absorption of proteins fats and as well as carbohydrates the bioluminescent dinoflagellates are the bioluminescent dinoflagellates are so example here is that uh luca then Conialox, those are the bioluminescent dinoflagellates. Which one of the following is not a member of Enterobacteriaceae? Enterobacteriaceae member. It's not an Enterobacteriaceae member. The answer is remaining all are like Cerasia, uh, Shigella, Klebsiella belongs to Enterobacteriaceae except Stigmatella. Stigmatella. As it belongs to the myxobacteria. The stage in the life cycle of plasmodium, which can be found both in the primary and secondary host. Question number 20 The stage in the life history of plasmodium, which can be found both in the primary and secondary hosts. It 
is a little bit tricky question, but the answer is gametocyte. The answer is gametocyte. 21 question Identify the mismatch below. So, mismatch melano 8, melano 8. Yes, it uh, uh, prevents the oxidation of succinate in Krebs cycle because it will be acting as uh, competitive inhibitor. Cyanide it inhibits the uh, cytochrome oxidase in electron transport system. Oligomycin it inhibits the ATP synthase enzyme. Uh, it binds to the FO particle. Then rotenone rotenone blocks. Complex 3 in ATP, it's wrong. Rotenone blocks complex 1. The answer is the wrong. The mismatch is uh, uh, only fourth. The answer is only fourth. Rotenone blocks the complex 1, not the complex 3 in electron transport system. All of the following events occurs during meiosis 1 except homologous pairs of chromosomes synapse and crossing over occurs yes separation of homologous chromosomes occurs yes in meiosis 1 sister chromatids of each homologous chromosome separate and migrate towards different uh, poles so that's wrong in meiosis 1 homologous chromosomes Will get separate and migrate towards the different poles, not sister chromatids. Then the cytoplasm divided produce two cells. Yes, that is correct. The answer is C is the wrong. Next question: Which one of the following methods can be utilized for removing peripheral proteins of the cytoplasmic or membrane? To remove peripheral proteins. Of the uh, cytoplasmic membrane to remove peripheral proteins of the cytoplasmic membrane, we can treat with what's called detergents. Detergents like sodium dodokyl sulfate or TREEN 20, TREEN 100. Those are uh, those uh, chemicals will act as a detergents. So they are involved in the uh, removal of the peripheral proteins which one of the following develop in the upper portion of the Vinogradsky uh, column so in the upper portion of the Vinogradsky column yes sulfate reducing bacteria green sulfur bacteria purple sulfur bacteria they are bottom of the uh, uh, column whereas thiobacilli will be there in the middle of the column it will be there in the middle of the column. Then after that, you will see uh, what is called photosynthetic bacteria in the form of cyanobacteria. The answer will be thiobacillus. Next question. If the GC content of the DNA molecule is 54%, then the, the content of A and T in this molecule is. So the GC is uh, uh, 54 uh, means 54 uh, remaining portion is uh, when you remove the uh, under minus 54 the remaining portion is uh, 46 then 46 divided by 2 means 23 so 23 adenine and 23 uh, thymines will be there so the answer is b so this is about the uh, fort e so i hope you understood well and uh, let's wait for the uh, part B. Thank you very much.